Aaron, for our look at the heat wave. Is it going away? I feel like we had a chance to go to Hurricane know, Harbor right? just Let's now go. from watching all that. The heat wave's getting better. It's not gone completely. It was still hot there. I mean, numbers for those inland valleys were still well into the 90s today. And there's something else we need to talk about briefly. The smoke in the sky. Look at the haze that's visible from our camera on top of the Salesforce Tower. Looking off towards the east, you can see a clearly developed inversion layer right there. There's the marine layer below it, trapping in the haze we're producing. And then above it, the higher levels, there is smoke out there drifting up from the south. You can see it over San Jose, which is a little closer to the source of the smoke. And that would be down in Big Sur, the Willow Fire, which we've told you about. Thankfully, not putting out a whole lot of smoke right now. But it was yesterday through the late afternoon and going into the early evening, and it's been much quieter today. Um, if you look at where it's coming from, there's the point source right there. So we're just looking at the concentrations of smoke in the mid and upper levels of the atmosphere. Watch what happens today. Flow in the atmosphere generally wants to bring that stuff our way. So we'll see it in the distance. We've got to spare the air out there today. But if you uh, just stick around a little bit longer, the onshore flow is going to get strong enough. It should help with that. And the Air Quality District has not put us under a spare of the air for tomorrow. And if you just look at the Golden Gate Bridge, you can see what's going on there. Strong onshore flow, plenty of clouds, the cooler air already coming in. Temperatures right now in the low to mid-70s for much of the Bay, 66 right now in Oakland. It's 96 in Concord. Those were the current numbers. These will be the morning lows tomorrow. We'll go back down into the mid-50s for most locations. In fact, low 50s up in the North Bay. And now the daytime highs for tomorrow, which look a lot better. Staying in the low 90s there. Concord 91, 93 Livermore. We'll go to 86 in San Jose and we'll top out in the mid 80s up in Santa Rosa. So big improvements there. Now as we look at the seven day forecast, the numbers get much better for the early part of this week. Look at the temperatures dip back down to the low 80s for inland spots as we get into Tuesday. And we'll get down into the low 70s for much of the bay. But there is a warming trend that takes us into next weekend. So we're going to have to go back up into the mid and upper 90s, maybe even more than that by the time we get into early next week. But I'm getting way too far ahead of myself and too far beyond that seven-day forecast. Enjoy the first half of this week. It's going to feel so much better.